Hi, it's Rudy. Welcome back to part two of this flashpoint with Blood Eagle Company. We're waiting for the Draconis Combine. Zeta Lance moved Captain Megorian out of Almedo Province two days ago. They're holding him in a bunker somewhere, somewhere under the ruins of New Volchi, a city that fell victim to a nuclear accident in 2977. Engage Zeta Lance and destroy their mechs. When you're finished, I'll scour their combat computers for the bunker's coordinates. Let's hope this is the last hoop we need to jump through before finding this guy. It's a decent spread. I'm not too worried about the Bowman group. At least it's not straight up the uh, pirates anymore. Now, are there limits on this? No, they're not limiting me still. Hmm. Got that raven. Pretty sweet little machine. Alright. Uh, Medusa and the Phoenix Hawk was pretty good. That stalker's doing the trick. This narc beacon seems to be better on something else. Like maybe if I stuck it on the Raven, for example. I could mark things and then I could have the big ones offload onto it. I wonder how long that would take to swap. I don't want to make you guys wait too long. Let's pull that off and the narc ammo. Leaves me with four. Can't quite put another one in. Unless I did two... Two fifteens. Six hundred rounds. Forty-five. Sixty-five. Let's go back with 15s all the way across. This way we can put in a few more heat sinks. And maybe one more LRM ammo. That should do the trick. Five days. So the stalker's out. Shouldn't be too hard. Let's refit this Raven. Pull the SRM-6 and the ammo. Stick this narc beacon on it. Grab that narc ammo. Perfect. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. How long in the Raven? Two days? Is check the hiring hall over here. Nobody interesting. Anything in the store? No black market. Hmm. Long range cluster cannon, too. That's interesting. And a UAC, too. Neat. Alright, let's just get that Raven back. Maybe the stalker. We can try this combo out now. Very good. Let's get back into it. All right, let's throw you in the Raven. Should be fine. Stalkers are good to go. keep them running. I know we're still too full over. I thought it would limit us to heavy because it, it said it was going to. Maybe it'll be just be the last encounter. I'm not sure, but we will see soon enough.
All right, time to take the battle to Zeta Lance. Now, I'm curious about this uh, Bowman group that Zeta Lance is working for. If it's going to show up more in the in the galaxy, or if it's just um, just for the flashpoint itself. Because if that's the case, I don't really care how they feel about us. Command interface initiated. Zeta Lance should be somewhere just ahead of you, Commander. There. Huh. That's strange. What is it, Meyer? My sensors picked up a weird signal coming from an object in geosynchronous synchronous orbit. Sort of a blip. It was there, but then... Hold up! I've got eyes on our targets. Zeta Lance is on the move, and it's heading this way. Incoming transmission. Blood Eagle Company. You're here. Big mistake. Mr. Bowman wants your heads, and we intend to deliver. What a coincidence! We're here for your heads, too! May as well get to it, Commander. Give him hell. When you're done, we'll recover that combat computers for Dr. Murad. Cool. Okay, we're going to be utilizing the stealth on this mission. Hopefully I won't get the uh, little machine destroyed. Sort of a uh, higher ground over here, but it's mostly on rocky terrain. Is that a road or a river? Not certain. Move everybody up into cover here. Moving out. There we go. Now this stealth only works until you get um, yeah. in visual range, and then it's a bit of a waste. Wow, cool. Destroyed city. That's neat. That must have been fun for them to make. On it. There's our first contact. I've got an unknown on sensors. Jenner, Locust, Panther, and Vulcan. Unfortunately, these guys are going to be in some trouble here. Roger that. You betcha! Everybody on the move? I'm still getting used to the new colors. I keep expecting to see the blue and the gold. We've got incoming drop pods, Commander. Who launched them? Does Bowman Group have a dropship in orbit? Negative XO. Judging by their trajectory, they were launched from an orbiting platform that our sensors had marked as space junk. According to my readings, it's completely unmanned and at least 300 years old. That would make it a relic of the Star League. Sumeri, I need you to send me those readings right away. On it. And I'm marking the drop pod's projected impact site on your screen, Commander. Watch your head. Is it going to rush right up into my circle? Sure is. Okay. Yep. Let's back up so that it's no longer in my circle. Get out of my zone. My way. Very nice. And let's uh, narc beacon this guy. Narc attached. Can you get in my circle? Oh yes, just barely. Nice try, Panther. Damage minimal. Mother Lover should be up. A oh, Vulcan, this is a new one I haven't seen either. Hey, 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 take it easy on the little raven. Gotta get him into cover. Reporting. 
heavy damage. Alright, only one of us is actually in the mix here. Well, one of them, I mean, the locust. Engaging. Eat it! Right torso, right arm. Got some close range shiz. Get a knockdown? Nope, did hurt the pilot though. Standing by. Behemoth, this is all you. Let's try out that narc beacon on the Jenner. Locking in all the See, now, my Off question down, is. <laughs> what can I do for you? Is with that number of LRMs. I read you, Commander. <laughs> Moving out. Still have done the trick without the narc beacon. I mean, it definitely helped. I won't lie. All right. Let's see what they got. Good night. Right torso, right arm. Another Pilot destroyed. Like We've got drones on the field, boss. Star League era. Looks from the looks of them. You called it, Doc. I. But this is incredible. They must have been sitting dormant on that platform for centuries. See how all. See how new they all look. They do look new, and that's a bad thing. Give them. Uh, I'll give them 20 seconds before they tear right into us. We'll deal with it if it happens. When it happens, it's going to. Commander Zeta Lance is still your primary target. If the drones fire and you take him out, but otherwise we need to bring down those mechs. I don't think that's going to be a problem. What do you need? Put everybody back into cloak. I'm going to brace here and cover. Stalker must not be in the bubble. Oh yeah, just outside of it. Good to know. Here come those drones. Waiting for orders. Alright, let's get back inside the bubble. On it. 65 LRF. Got the unsteady. For some reason, the Vulcan entrenched. Uh, let's just end this locust. Engaging physical attack. When I change this one over, it doesn't do as much straight up damage, uh, but it does a hundred stability damage and a hundred uh, melee damage. Good to go. Multi-target here. Glitch making everything easy. Let's go BB. You get a headshot, and you get a headshot. CQC sweet. He's got a close quarter combat sweet on the Vulcan. That's neat. That's a knockdown too. Yeah, critical hit. I don't know why this flashpoint didn't impose those uh, limits. Ready for orders. Everybody's still in the bubble. Copy that. I'm actually really happy that this. I'll take the narc beacon out, but we'll need it. Really happy that. I brought this raven along on this mission, and those drones probably can't just take shots on us from a distance that way. Hit the pilot again. Any good hit on him is going to finish him, though.
Good night. Oh well. We'll get a piece of it. Ah, I should turn those flamers off. I'm just wasting them. The single flamer on it, on there is not all that useful. I mean, short of a, a vehicle or a mech that's already super hot. Orders. Heading out. If you can hear that, there's still construction in the background. Not my favorite thing, I gotta say. Uh, let's let's just give him 30 of the 95s. This should do the trick. Copy that. Commander. Well, I guess I was wrong. But if she hits with this, this should finish Roger it. Roger that! Firing on target! And stay down! Alright, come at me, drones. Wow, this raven totally cheesed this mission. If these guys are anything like receiving you, can I move up without taking everybody out? Yes, I can. On my way. If I'd come in here without the Raven, I have a feeling that the um, those guys would have been bombarding us from the beginning. A permit. Lark attached. Can you get in my circle? Almost. Oh, just barely. Wow. Let's fix that. Ah, oh, I didn't turn the flamer off again. Engaging physical attack. Out of my space. Well, at least the flamer's empty now. Enemy unit destroyed. Apparently, there's only two of them. Yeah, I know, because I didn't turn it off at all. I really wanted to fight in the broken buildings, but... But I'm in the circle. How can he even target me? There must be short-range missiles. Warning. Armor low. Yes, Commander. That's done it, Commander. I'll scoop up Zeta Lance's combat computers. When Farrah locates Captain Magorian's bunker, we'll be off to the races. I'll do what you need, but for the time being, we have more pressing concerns. No, we don't. This is the job, Doctor. Yes, Darius, I know. But the platform that just launched those drones was SLDF. It's been sitting dormant for three centuries, and it just came back online now. Why are we all fighting over a ship from the great beyond? Funny timing, don't you think? Do you think this has something to do with the derelict? You think it doesn't? <sighs> okay, maybe now's the time to talk about those drones. Let's return to orbit. We need to loop Shugo Yamaguchi in on what's happening here. I've tried. He's indisposed. You better get back up here anyway, though. I've got something you need to see. Mission successful. Yeah, that raven made that super cheap. I mean, also the fact that we were like two skulls higher than the actual damage, the, the da danger rating. That was pretty quick. I might run another one. Depending. Nobody wounded. Take a piece of that Vulcan. Might as well take the full Jenner for Cell, and I guess a piece of that Panther, unless they got something cool. No, totally destroyed those vehicles, eh? I suspect a wrap-up.
Unless this is the end. That mech is ready to fight, Commander. Scrap that mech for the cash. Uh, okay, there is a wrap up. Well, then we'll end it after this. Okay, Meyer, what's the emergency? Remember that orbital platform? The one that launched all those drones? You mean like five minutes ago? It's trying to talk to us. The damn thing has pinged our comm system five times since you left the planet's surface. I'll pause for a second to let that think in. If it wants to talk, we should talk. Get it on the line. If you say so, Commander, I'm establishing contact with a 300-year-old weapons platform. Buckle in, everyone. Shit's about to get weird. Your view screen fills with cool blue light as Sumeri establishes the connection. The light coalesces and solidifies into an unfamiliar landscape. Blood Eagle Company. Senior staff consists of the following. Rudy, Mother Lover, Mother Lover, Commander, Darius Olivieri, Executive Officer, Dr. Farad Murad, Farah Murad, Engineer, Yang Vertranen, Chief Mech Tech, Sumeri Meyer, Pilot and Navigator. Is this manifest correct, Commander Mother Lover? That's us. To whom or what are we speaking? My official designation is SLDFPT CGVR. I'm the last surviving product of Project Triage. Authorized 27650612 by Major General Jeremy McLean on the 19th Army LVI Corps. I have also been programmed to respond to any of the following informal designations Caregiver, Den Mother, Motor Bjorn. You may refer to me as any of the above aliases. Motor Bjorn? Sounds like baby mother. What's that mean? Swedish. Mother Bear. Oh, okay. I believe that the name was intended to humanize me. It's all, it is also evocative of my primary directive, the gathering and protection of disaster survivors in this scenario, my metaphorical cubs. Folks, we got ourselves a winner. I'll reserve the right to call it Mama Bear, though. Now that the introductions are out of the way, I'd like to know why your drones fired on my lance. The ongoing defenses of New Volchi is one of my ter tertiary objectives. When you initiated a firefight in the ruins, I was compelled to intercede. I regret any injury my drones may have caused your company, and I am hopeful that the circumstances of our introduction will not prevent us from helping one another in the future. Helping one another. You want us to do something for you. Figures. Everybody's got an angle, even an ancient computer. Of course it does, Meyer. That's a universal constant. Tell us what you need, Mama Bear. Who knows, maybe we can work something out. For the past half a century, I've been guiding a derelict spacecraft, the Dobrev, towards Tarragona. On the eve of its arrival, it disappeared. I believe the organization you were fighting to be responsible for the derelict's disappearance. I must learn where they have taken it. It is imperative that I recover that ship. You're here to rescue Captain Gaku Magorian? He was taken prisoner by the same people who hijacked the derelict. We're here to do that. Then we are pursuing complementary objectives, Doctor, and I suggest that we pool our resources to achieve them. For the sake of the argument, let's say we help you. What's in it for us? Because we're pirates now. We're not good guys. <laughs> My combat drones are standing by and ready to assist your rescue efforts. All I ask in return is access to the Bowman Group's computer systems. This arrangement should prove purely beneficial for you and your company, Commander. I ask nothing that you cannot give me for free. Sounds reasonable. What form would this assistance take, exactly? I could have my drones attack a nearby armory. That should lure away the prison's garrison, leaving the way for a light, nimble lance to conduct the rescue operation. Alternatively, I could liberate Captain Magorian myself, but I would need your lance to serve as the distraction. Should you choose this option, I would recommend allocating your heaviest battle mechs for the job. Yeah, we'll be the distraction. I like going in heavy. Our heavies will attack the armory to draw the op for his defenses away. Interesting choice. Not what I would have gone with, but you're the boss. Your decision is acknowledged, Commander Mother Leva. While your lance distracts the prison garrison, my drones will move in to rescue Captain Magorian. 
you will have him alive and unharmed. That's it then, we have a plan. Let's get to it, Commander. Time's a wasting. Cool. Okay, what an interesting twist. When we come back, uh, instead of running it right now, we'll do it again next time we uh, I post. And uh, when we come back, we will be getting aid from this AI. Now, we could have snuck in there and just tried to liberate him while the drones did their work, but I want to get into the thick of it. Plus, with two skulls, I have a feeling we're not going to have any trouble knocking these guys down. I want to thank you all for joining me. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. If you haven't already, please subscribe. It'll show up at the end of the video down in that bottom right corner. And I'll see you guys all next time. Tell you no, I don't fuck around. I'm playing every day. Tell you no, I don't fuck around. Ask your mom, she'll tell you the same.